¿Te gusta ir a comer paella? Oh, ya bien. Hello, Ikin Mari. Hola, me llamo Lucía. Encantada a conocerte. Do you like my paella? It's made from meat-free pork. Ew, are you trying to poison me? Soy de España y I'm traveling the world. Wow, I've always wanted to do that, but I never got a chance because of my work. I'm a civil engineer and I'm building a motorway. Oh, oh, my love, the dad's on a yaki sort of fazania. That's wrong with you. Oh, goopy idiot. It's too small here. She's fine now and she encouraged me to become a translator in America but my visa got denied so I, I decided to go to Britain instead. So here I am. Wow, that's quite something. I ended up getting a promotion and permanently moving to Britain. Oh, I just remembered there's a general staff meeting today. We should probably go. Okay. I think it is, and I think it's a Scottish person as well. Small world. Did they meet in a plane a few years ago? Yeah, I think we did. So what have you been doing since then? Well... <laughs> I was actually not trying to become an actor, but the film producer said I didn't have any talent. The name's Bond. James Bond. <laughs> Typical. So then I decided to become an artist, but that didn't work out because I simply do not have the time or patience. So I finally ended up getting a job as a builder because I was running out of money fast. Ooh. We should all definitely meet up at some point. That sounds like a plan. Sadly, Lithia had to go back to Catalonia because of the political situation and they wanted to support their family. Alfred was sent back to Poland when Brexit started and currently is writing music for small minimalist bands. <laughs> Mary remained in Britain and continued to move up in the company. Even though these three people ended up being separated, they had a great friendship and enjoyed and felt welcome during their time in Britain. In 2016, there were 39,626 people removed or voluntarily departed after they'd been told they had to leave the UK. Poland is one of the top 10 of enforced removal or voluntary departure in 2016 from the UK.